bless up viewers and subscribers and my have a story for talk about today right and and one of the worst stories me hear in a while when I when I so find out why I say so anyway I could get tonight detectives in Clarendon are investigating an incident in which a man is suspected to have attacked a family at their home in Stewarton district Moko Clarendon yesterday and then hanged himself in the community the attack left 14 year old Leroy Hamilton dead while his 53 year old grandmother and his 24 year old sister were admitted at hospital the man suspected of attacking the family has been identified as 41 year old Craig Lawrence reports are that about 2 25 a.m. Lawrence reportedly went to the family house and was refused entry he however gained entry chopped the older woman in the face and the right hand and then set the house on fire the granddaughter reportedly received severe burns both women were admitted at hospital Hamilton's burnt remains were found in the house during the cooling down operations. Lawrence was subsequently found hanging from a tree in a section of the community. Neighbors expressed shock at Lawrence's actions. He sells at the Lennon High School gate and he is a pleasant person from interacting with him. He never seemed the type to do something like that. We definitely not seeing this one coming, a neighbor said. Reports from other neighbors are that Lawrence and 24-year-old had their little arguments occasionally, but nothing that would concern them. It is alleged that the 24-year-old wanted to end the relationship and that may have caused Lawrence's reaction. Counselor for the division, Romaine Morrison said, I am using this tragic occasion to appeal to couples to find a better way of resolving your conflict without it coming to this. Alright, so people, when you see why I say that story is one of the worst I see in a while, man, you are heartless, you know, because watch you, all the grandmother, the man, are wet up. You see what I say? And you see, some of them women here, they are not going to learn them lesson. And you see, some women, where they with certain men, they cause certain things to happen to the family. Because guess what? In a Jamaica, they have a saying, say, you can't catch Quaker, you catch him shut. In other words, for those of you who don't understand, if I can't hold you, I can hold your mother, or your father, or your sister, or your brother, or the baby from breast. Some women will go lie down with certain men. All them do, I put them family in a risk. You understand? Or at risk, I should I say. You have to know what you do. I guarantee you, say, that man, I know the first time things that happen like that because in the story it said them have them little argument occasionally but that way the people them think the man probably did a beat or did a liquor and them thing there you see what i say we don't really know the full story but for him to something like that me not think say at, at the first him and make certain move like that i feel like him probably put him on panel but me can't really pass judgment you understand what i say but if a woman see a man do certain things, certain signs are there, she for just let go the relationship from early. Cause once the man invests certain amount of feelings, you know, and every man can take hurt, you know. Some man nah, I mean, a woman left them. Oh, they mother they mother rather kill the woman and kill themselves. Or kill the woman and go to jail. So whole heap of man stay so. And right now, I don't know where man get that mentality from. Because in the world you have so much woman. Can't stress over one woman because sometimes when you lose one woman, you get even a better one. You understand? You and certain woman just not compatible. As a man for look on things, say what? It does not work out, move on. You understand? Simple as that. Anyway, viewers and subscribers, wanna comment and make me know what you think about that story. Bless up, one love.